You know, we were very definitely radical women. We wanted to make a revolution. We had a series of chants that we kind of gathered around and, you know, in a little circle. And one of them was something like Wall Street, Wall Street, mightiest wall of Wall Street. The reaction of the people on Wall Street was sort of stunned. Wall Street was kind of the symbol of, uh, of power in this country. We wanted to overthrow that system of power and replace it with something more egalitarian. These executives came out and security guards came out and tried to tell us we couldn't be there. And, and we just um, did our thing. So I don't think it was a negative image for a lot of us. Even as a child, I saw witches as sort of a symbol of a kind of independence. I liked dressing up as a witch for Halloween. And, you know, as I got older and learned about women being burned at the stake and called witches, it created curiosity. These were women who were, were outcasts in a sense because they didn't want to follow the norm at the time. They didn't want to conform to the role that had been set out for them. It was, for me, uh, just mind-blowing. It was an epiphany for me to be able to see my life uh, as part of a, a societal issue. Protesting the beauty pageant, which was so symbolic of uh, the objectification of women uh, and the perfect image, exactly, uh, was exciting to us. We did things like um, have a freedom trash can where we could throw objects of our oppression, high heels, girdles, bras, a puppet like a cutout about six feet tall that somebody else brought a sheep with a Miss America banner across it. ovens started popping up. A bunch of uh, women had heard about we'd done and started their own groups to do similar things. You know, we were really happy. Um, with what we were doing. I mean, these were like spirited actions and um, gave us a feeling of empowerment. And the fact that we had that demonstration announced to the world, sort of, to the women of the world, some of the women who were feeling like us, 
that there was this movement and that they weren't alone. <laughs>